The key takeaways are probably the importance and the relevance of the work we're doing together, the research. If you think about the African continent and the fact that it's a very young population, but not just that it's a young population, there is increasing growth, questions being asked, and the countries are beginning to sort of own their space. And because of the young population, we're certainly the next frontier and we have to prepare for that frontier. And if Africa is going to really break out, the research is important. What, how do we shape our future? Now, one thing that's very clear to me is that there is a renaissance. It usually starts with the humanities, the arts, and you can see that the African continent is coming into its own in terms of the culture and owning their own space. The next thing will be the, the science, and I think we as a group are being proactive and we're saying we're not going to wait and play catch up. I saw a lot of, a lot of energy today. Uh, all the universities, they want to work together. The universities from Europe and from Africa because we are confronted with a lot of uh, world challenges and we need more capa capacity and to work together to solve these kind of problems and to do research. That's a great opportunity to meet all these people in these universities. I think also if you think in terms of the history between Africa and the EU, it's not always been comfortable. And I think we're having a chance to rebuild. And because we do have history together, there's a lot of understanding um, and we know ourselves sort of, but we have the chance to make it a much more positive um, collaboration. And I think on both sides, we're, we're ready for that and we will co-create the future. I think the world situation, the geopolitical situation is changing very fast. Uh, for Europe it's very important to have more cooperation with our neighbors in Africa uh, because uh, I think we need more orientation in Europe to Africa and to Southeast Asia and there is the youth and uh, we are confronted with uh, problems, challenges without borders so we need to work together with each other and we are doing that now.